Hello everyone, it is Aiko Sneem and I'm back with more uh, Tales of the Stevia. So let's see, last time for a call... Oh yeah, for a call we went to the museum. Which apparently was abandoned, although it turns out it was... Um, I don't know what that thing was, but it became an alien, Helios. Sorry, almost everything in art. The reason because of that is because uh, of the humans destroying heart, selling heart, and yes, the love of heart completely destroyed this place. Anyway, now, now I'm gonna try to find a way to destroy the, the Draco, whatever it's called. And um, while looking at the sky, I noticed there was this giant moon. It's actually kind of pretty. So cool. Anyway, let's go. To the star. Over there. Doo -doo -doo. This is it. So we're gonna use this place. So how are you gonna do it? Ooh. Alright, go for it. You got it! Power! Ooh. Ah! Hey, That's some power you got there. I can only handle one shot. Only one shot. Oh, make it count. <clears throat> one shot is enough. Saray, I'll do the aiming. Right. And I'll pick when to fire. Hmm. Now! Here we go. Oh, got him. <laughs> nice. Nice indeed. Ooh. Hey there, motherfucker. Remember? All right, come on. Time to smash him. Drake is this big and this strong? You can't be serious. He should know the difference in size and scale of dragon nuts by now. We are here to do whatever must be done. That's right. As we are now, we can do it. Well, come on. Try not to die out there. Break down. Now's my chance. Come on. Blue fury. Open the floodgates. Double arrow. Ocean flip! Blue flurry! First! Break down! Open the floodgates! Bubble arrow! Save zero! Open the floodgates! Come on! Taking care of this thing! Blue flurry! Blue flurry! Right here! Open the floodgates! Bubble arrow! Oh, Blue Blade Blue 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 smashing. Open the 
Yeah. Sure, we might not be strong enough to beat a dragon yet, but... Yeah, we will get there someday! Yeah, someday. Oh, I see that. He's happy. Yeah, that was not easy. I really need to increase this guy's strength. Hello. The flames of purification. Might you be the shepherd? Yep. Hello. So you must be Marlin's. Guardian Seraph Rohan. Or should I what? say, I was. I very nearly became a dragon. I have no right to continue protecting this town. Come on. Don't say that. Don't like that. Seraph Rohan. I am Alicia Difta, princess of the Kingdom of Highland. It is we who must bear the blame. We who corrupted the hearts of the people and set you on the path to becoming a Hellion. But I assure you that I shall set things right. If you must punish anyone, let it be me. Oh, So please, if it's still possible, let us have your blessing just this once. You're an impassioned young princess. I'll give you that. You can see me? Why don't they still yes. say? I have pledged myself as Soray's squire. Have you? And you're okay? Huh? Uh. What? I see. The malevolence in town has lowered significantly. You're the one who dispelled it? Well, little by little. We all did. Oh. Aww. Hmm. Then so be it. I'll extend my blessing. I want to help too! Aww. Thank, Thank you, you so much. It appears the corruption has yet to spread to this tree. Using this as a vessel, I shall expand the blessed domain. So the tree shall become a, a huh? celestial tree, this? I guess. What happened? There's still a mega powerful Hellion running around near here. What? The domain it's creating is in the way, and we can't stop the invasion of the lesser Hellions. A major Hellion? Where? To the southwest. It isn't far. Southwest. Saray, we must defeat it. But. If we leave the town in this state? With your guards all a-sleeping and your hellions all a-creeping? Sorry? Uh, you okay, Sorry? Sorry, I just blanked out for a second there. You need a rest. In. Now. Oh. Indeed. Good ideas will surely come after we take a breather. Yeah, we've been doing quite a lot. Mm. The young shepherd's starting to deteriorate. I ought to be more understanding. Deteriorate? <laughs> yeah, what the hell did you mean by de deteriorate? Let's see, where is he? Hey there. Darling, Sorry, we are really back. found yourself a peach of a shepherd. <laughs> Good on you. Why, thank you. You two go way back, don't you? There was a time once when the Norman Seraphim and I traveled together. Lila was like an idol to us. <gasps> At one point, all 49 of us begged her to make us her sublords. You didn't what? go for it? Um, no. Let's all just be friends, she told us. What a cruel woman. Well, 49 is a bit much. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. The trauma nearly killed us. We all scattered over the globe to be alone with our melancholy. What? Surely that wasn't necessary. You oh my god. A harpy. I don't think I'm a harpy. 
<laughs> it's all so horrible good. Woman. Us Norman, I guess. we roll with life's punches. We all treasure it as a bittersweet memory from when we was carefree youngins. This nostalgia trip is boring me, but it's true that Norman have useful abilities. If we find any more, let's catch him. It'd be sad if they turned into hellions. I'd get a kick out of seeing my old buddies again. I promise we'll help you folks out. Hmm. So all 49. Well, we are covering this guy. It's gonna be maybe 48. Well, either way, it's gonna be a lot of them. Also, what the hell did he mean by surveys the terrority? The terrorite. Huh. I guess something's going on with Saray. I mean, it's blinking out and... Hmm... I mean, understandable with all the stuff was going on, but still... Anyway... Let's go to the inn, rest, eat food, all the good stuff. Hmm. Oh, let's go for this one. This one! Ugh. Yummy. That's it? Oh, I was hoping for a cutscene. Oh well. Morning! How are you feeling? Right as rain. Good. We don't need a sick shepherd. That'd be bad! <laughs> and precisely how long had you been saving that one? <laughs> Looks I like get we it. got our saray back. Hmm? Oh. The shepherd. Perfect timing. Oh, that means the, the bridge is fixed. We heard about the bridge. You're a superstar. Well, you know. What can I say? You know? I'm that good. Well, whatever. Anyway, we need you to sign for this. Hey. Huh? Me? More medicine. It was ordered by a guy named Naif. Oh. Huh. Nice. See? Buck up. We got this. <laughs> I guess you're right. Also a message. A message? I found a group of mercenaries headed toward Marland and asked them to protect the town, but they refused me. I have asked for additional reinforcements from Lady Lake, but it will take some time. That's all. Hmm. Mercenaries! They might work in a pinch! Can mercenaries stand against the Hellions? Probably not the Hellhounds, but they might be able to handle lesser Hellions. They are vicious, but they are visible. And little. But they already refused the guard job. Well, I suppose it's I could try asking thing. again as sincerely as possible. <gasps> Wouldn't hurt to oh go try. confused. Thanks for passing along the message. Hey, why are you going through all this trouble anyway? Hmm? Why? Why? I mean, you can't just not help people in trouble. Exactly. Hmm. I get it. Yeah, this feels good to help. I get that you're weird. What the fuck? Mini. Now, where is well, the medicine going? Well, excuse me if I enjoy helping people. The sanctuary. Gotcha. Oh, hey. You didn't happen to run into a group of mercenaries on the way here, did you? You mean the woodsmen? They came with us. I think they're probably still in town. They said they were gonna stock up. Ooh. Yes, this, so I guess we're gonna have to go and look for them. Wherever they are. And get your supplies. We can't be wasting time in a crazy what town like this one. 
What happened? Wild dogs were attacking the sanctuary, but these guys put them down. Oh. Gotta admit, that was some fine teamwork. Those dogs are Hellions. And no pushovers either. Well, for a human anyway. <laughs> oh, excuse me, may I ask you a favor? Huh? You're talking to the woodsman, bub. We don't do babysitting. And we won't get your kitty out of a Very tree. Very funny. It's about a job only you guys can handle. I'm the leader, Lucas. What's this job you speak of? We want you to protect Marlin for a little while. Yeah, we were asked that before, but turned it down. Ain't taking no chances guarding over a place that's diseased. Hey, boss. But I'm the kid you're talking to is the shepherd. The miracle bridge maker? This scrawny little duckling? You're pulling my chain, right? Yeah, it is me. Calm we down, found a way to bring Marlin back to how it was, but we have to leave town to do it. And the guards here aren't in a condition to fight because of the epidemic. Yeah, we need a lot so of help. So you want us to handle it, huh? We do the grunt work so you can get the glory. Is that how it is? Not exactly. It's nothing of the sort. Huh, <laughs> so you Maybe say. Besides, every bit helps. What do you need? Let me tell you something, Mr. Shepherd. Money talks and horse crap walks. If you're serious about it, put your cash on the table, then we'll talk. Is that so? Some money. How about it, Mr. Shepherd? Well, luckily me. I do actually have the money. Well, well. Looky here. The Shepherd comes through. Guess we really can trust you after all. Of course. You can always you trust, trust whoever money, gives you money. And what else, pray tell, should be my motivation? Duty, chivalry? Let's say this no epidemic worries. kills one of my subordinates. Will duty and chivalry step in to take care of his grieving family? W well It's okay, but if Alicia. I have money, I can I make sure they've got a safety net. That's the kind of contract I have with my team. That's why, in return, they're willing to put their lives on the line. <sighs> you need to start facing reality, sister. Facing reality, huh? So, you want us to guard the town, huh? We'll take the job, but on one condition. In return... Yes? Can we do whatever we want to this town while you're away? Saray, are you sure about this? It's fine. No one who values contracts so highly would do anything sleazy. You passed the test. Oh. All right, you bums, we got a job to do. We're staying in Marland and guarding it. Alpha and Bravo squad secure the perimeter. Charlie handle things in town. I'll go tell the guards what's up. Huh. These orders come so from the shepherd himself. The right Don't him. slack off out there. He makes a fair point. Ah! Hmm? What's this? Your change. It's our policy to accept a reasonable price for the job we do. Well, they're cheaper than we imagined. We may not look it, but we value fair our enough. customers. <laughs> Then. There you go. So, oh, that's well, fair enough. Okay, so now we have money. We should be able to try to increase my my equipment. I need to do some fusing. Try to increase them. Otherwise, I'm still gonna be stuck with cheap stuff. Ah. <sighs> Hold on, let me see. Do we have do we have anything new? Stronger? Hmm. Huh. 
Okay then, I just finished uh, fusing some stuff and increases other items. Yeah, I think I'm good. So now all we have to do is go to that other place. Uh, the place where the strong Malevus is. God. I swear, every time I say certain words, I can feel my lips uh, twisting and everything. Ugh. Some English words can be hard. Hmm. So I guess it's that way. Yeah, most likely. Found it. Totally found it. Ooh, thank you. Oh, going this way. So I guess I'm gonna try and defeat this thing, whatever this is, and then I'll probably stop. My hair's standing on end. There's something lurking deep inside here. Yes, even I can sense something wrong here. Hmm. Well then, let's go. I don't think we've checked that monolith out yet. I remember this place was in the Celestial Record. Ooh. Hmm. This forest was a ruin too. We haven't found a ruin yet that wasn't crawling with Hellions. The malevolence really is widespread. I'm sorry. <sighs> it tears me mm. up inside seeing all these ruins defiled. But if we purify the Hellions while we explore the ruins, isn't that like two birds with one stone? Think about yeah, how jealous true. of our adventures literally every other historian and archaeologist will be. You're such a sweet, simple soul. You know that? Huh? What? You're right. Fretting over this won't get us any closer to oh our answers. God. We should all take a page out of Miklio's book and <laughs> laugh at our worries. And if Saray thinks you're happy-go-lucky, I think Miklio's in shock. <laughs> Let's get going, touchy-feely Miklio. Hey, <laughs> you're doing this on purpose. Or for short, touchy Filio. No, no nicknames. <laughs> I love it all. Damn it, this is why I tell. Could this be Wait, what? Elixir? The all healing panacea made by Mountellus? Oh my, what a delightful butterfly. Whoops. Hey, I I'm guess right it's here. Random o'clock again. Anyway, the elixir. You think it's the real thing? According to the celestial record, the methods used to make elixir were lost ages ago. And look! An icky beetle going creepo crawl a creepo crawl. Guess we won't know well, for sure unless we there. try it. You think that's safe? It'll just be a drop. Whoa! I feel rejuvenated. It is the real thing. Nice. Wish we could just buy this at the store. That'll be difficult. The only remaining elixir left in the world of humans is in custody of the church. The church, oh. huh? <laughs> Ran out of bugs, I take it. <laughs> Number of bugs, eh? Ooh, Can perfect. you tell me more about equipment skills? Way to have your head in the game. First, let's go over the basic skills. Basic skills can be broken down into ten groups with five different elements. So in total, it's ten times five. Think you can do the math, genius? There are 50 Norman named after the basic skill they offer. Each one has the power to draw forth that specific skill. So if you find a skill that you like, go find that Norman and send them off to the Lord of the Land to do your dirty work. Elements and skill groups aren't just for tweaking the effects of your skills. They're also closely linked to bonus skills. That's all the time we have for today. See you again next week! What the next week? We're doing this again? Oh! Is that so? Now then, this time we'll be covering skill groups. We are not going to talk about bonus skills. Doing this? We are the ones doing the teaching around here. Shut up and listen. Yes, ma'am. Okay. It wouldn't be prudent to explain everything at once, so I'll start off with the ones you can obtain in the beginning phases. So first, there's the status column. This increases basic stats by a certain percentage. Here, it's wise to improve upon your given strengths. Then there's the HP column. If you're prone to damage, it's best to improve on this. Or just don't get hit in the first place, doofus. But anyways, okay. as you can see, aligning the same skill group together to carry out a tactical battle is one option that you have. And that's where the bonus skill comes into play. See you again next week! Next okay. week again? Well, 
I guess we're gonna have to wait. Oh, God damn it. Ha! You could beat me? Well, guess again. I'm gonna take care of the other thing. And then I'm gonna stop. All right, motherfucker. I'm here. Bring it. Wherever you are. Ready? Yes. Oh god damn it. I just skip a small one. Now I need to care of a big one. Oh, is, is this like the plant boss of the area? No, it looks like a mutant hellion. Like Ouroboros. Mutant hellion? It's probably the effect of the anomalous oh, orbs. Just like the ones Knight Arthur and Echidna have. Let's keep our guard up. to notice the dimmer stars when they shine, they say. <sighs> oh, God damn it. Oh, God, my butt. Oh, I've been seeing too much. Oh, but there you go, it's fine. Now the done. blessing should return to Marlin. Blind from one of the eyes? Eat this! Oh, these are good. How is she?
You couldn't see it, could you? Not because... So the Squire's Pact is affecting you. No, I just wasn't paying attention. Alicia and Miklio nearly died because of you. And, uh... Well, I'm not dead, and Saray was only hiding it for Alicia's sake. I understand that, but even so... He's at his limit. Some things is best not to hide. I know. Saray? Alicia! Thank goodness. Don't worry mm. about me. It looks like we were able to expand Rohan's domain. Well, that's that. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I do want to check in on Lucas's crew. Here. Thanks. Oh boy. So yeah, as you guys can probably guess, but all those scenes with, uh, for instance, this cutscene where Mikkel was talking with uh, Saray, but it didn't stop him coming from one area, the way he acted. <sighs> because of the way, uh, in a way, uh, because of how was, um, Alicia, he's having a hard time seeing. And I used to say that she, she cannot, I mean, he cannot see shit. Look at that. Things seem to be better. Now, how is it inside of that? I guess we'll find out in the next video, because right now I need to stop. Uh, I need a rest. My butt is trying to complain. And I see my... Uh, I see chocolate that must be devoured. So yeah, run, please. Like the video, subscribe, comment, hit the bell. And I'll see you all on the next video. Bye-bye.